Tom, I want to just ask you this question. I'm going to let you and Brian kind of fill in a lot of the gaps here because a lot of people, as we've covered a lot of terrain, we've got to go back and fill in a few, uh, a few areas that we may have missed. Bring us up to speed on the defense authorization bill to which this amendment is attached. Well, currently in the Senate, uh, it was voted out of committee um, <clears throat> by party line vote, more or less. Uh, differences on the uh, abortion issue as well as on the don't ask, don't tell issue brought over different Democrats to vote on those amendments, except the majority of the Democrats voted for it. However, this is not the first time that the Senate Democrats have used the defense authorization to push a liberal agenda, and they also realize this is going to be a tough election year for them. So currently the bill itself is somewhat stalled because um, even though the Senate Democrats as a majority support uh, turning the abort military facilities into uh, abortion uh, clinics and also uh, overturning the so-called don't ask, don't tell policy implemented by President Clinton, uh, they know that the American people are not. Uh, and so what we need to do is make sure that they keep on hearing from the American people that this is completely unacceptable, uh, that we should use the military in this way. 